So this exercise is to strengthen the soleus muscle, so the deep calf muscle, links into Achilles tendon issues, chronic calf tears, and plantar fascia issues in the feet. So the way you start it, you've got about 90 degree angle here, about 90. And the feet are in line with the knees, that's in line with the hips. And the first thing you're doing, and you make sure your head's comfortable, you might need to put a pillow or a towel underneath, so your neck should be comfortable. You don't want to be lifting your head all like this. It will just feel really uncomfortable. Neck soft helps everything. All rehab exercises are helped by a soft neck. So I push through the balls of my feet here, not through my toes. So I'm pushing through this part of my foot here, the ball of the foot, not onto the toes. So I push through there and I lift my heels up as high as I can. And that already is got a strong contraction on my soleus. It's almost wanting to cramp, which is very, very common. Then from here, I take my pelvis off the floor by tucking my pelvis. So I tuck it a little bit this way. So the pelvis comes off the floor. There's not much. So my pelvis is off the floor, but my lower back is still touching the floor. And that's all I do to start with. And you'll feel it mainly in the calves. Your hamstrings might get a little bit involved. So you may need to just hang out here doing three sets of as much time as you can hold this. So 30 seconds is really good at the start. Build it up to a minute. If this is feels pretty easy, and over a course of a week or so, it probably will feel easy, you lift one leg off. So now all the pressure is going in this one leg. I've still got the pelvis off the floor. A little bit of a tuck in the pelvis. And I hold that for that 30 seconds, building up to a minute. And of course I'll do the other side. And how I can get this wrong is I lift the pelvis up too high. So it's just a little bit off the floor. Uh, the ankle, the ankle can do weird things where it wants to sort of dive out. So it's sort of a dive out straight of that position. You want it to be straight. The heel drops. So we want to keep it pushed up as much as we can. If your feet are out too far, you find you, you don't get much of a lift through the heel. And the hemis get involved a lot, which is not too bad, but you just can't lift very high. And if you go too close, the hemi can cramp, and it's just not giving you the right lever uh, to get the calf and the soleus working.